Hey everybody, so today's video is going to be all about my cage. I get so many questions almost on every single one of my videos about what kind of cage I have, where did I get it, and how much it costs me and stuff like that. So I do have another cage right besides the rats right now that is a double ferret nation. So I thought it was a good time to kind of show you guys what the difference is and stuff like that. So I have here is a double critter nation. And it's not focusing, but um, the double coordination is a model 162. So if you wanted to get the single model, it would just be the section below and then the first section. So that would be a single coordination, and it is a model 161. So in the second cage, I am watching my friend's chinchilla. Um, and that is little Scooter. And he's just a little black chinchilla. He is currently being housed in a double ferret nation. It's an older model, so the label is torn off, and it also has different pans. But I figured it was kind of good for you guys to see the differences between the two, and the sizes are just slightly different. So when it comes to the actual dimensions of the double critter nation, it is 36 inches long by 24 inches wide and 63 inches in height. So it's definitely a very tall cage. And the Ferret Nation is half an inch shorter. It's 62 and a half inches in height. And then it's only 25 inches wide. So just a little different. So you can see here that it's just slightly shorter. And another thing that's different is the bars. So on the Critter Nation here, the bars are a half an inch and then the Ferret Nation, they are an inch apart. And in the Critter Nation, they go horizontal. And on the Ferret Nation, they go vertical. So it's actually not recommended to have a Ferret Nation for rats because when they're small or even um, small females, petite females like Ingrid, it could slip out of the Ferret Nation bars pretty easily. So if you're going to be purchasing them for rats, then I would definitely recommend the Critter Nation, even though it's a little bit more expensive. I do have full review on the cage and a bunch of cage tours that I will post below in the description. And if you have the money to spend, then I would definitely recommend this cage over all of the other cages for rats. Okay, so I also get a lot of questions about how much the cage cost me and where did I get it. So I suggest to people to go ahead and search online for the double Critter Nation and you'll see that it is on a bunch of different websites and even its own here. But I believe that I got mine at drfostersandsmiths.com. Um, you can check this site regularly. They do have the cage on sale sometimes. Um, it's not on sale right now. But you do also want to remember that if you're going to be getting the single unit, it's going to be a little bit less expensive than the double. Um, so maybe later on you can get the add-on unit, which um, in the end it's still cheaper to go ahead and get the double unit at once. But um, you know, if you don't have the money right then, that's fine. And you can also check on ferret.com. Sometimes usually has it pretty cheap um, or cheaper. So right now it's $203 and shipping is only $5. So that would be your best bet if you're going to get the cage now. However, I guess it says here that it's temporarily out of stock. But it'll be back in probably next week. So yeah, this is just a way that you can search for the cage and where it's at and stuff like that. They do sell the cage at PetSmart now. Um, but it's usually pretty expensive, like almost $300, so it's definitely cheaper to get it online. So I hope this video helped you guys, and if you have any questions, just go ahead and comment below, and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.